Hey guys, it's Dane with DynastyBreaks.com. It is the 23rd of July, 2021. We are ending out uh, Friday night with a product we haven't done in a long time. Uh, just released, they only made 160 cases of this stuff. This is TriStar Autographed Platinum Edition Mini Helmets. Uh, we have eight helmets here. We just opened the case box on our live stream. So if you want to see us open that, take out all the eight helmets. I've got the other seven uh, over here next to me. Um, don't all fit on the screen at once. Uh, we're using case two of 160. It is serial numbered. And here's how this is going to work. We're going to open the eight helmets. Uh, George is going to type those in up here where it says mini helmets up here at the top. And then we are going to randomize everyone's name that's in the break for our draft order. You guys are going to get to pick these helmets draft style. We are looking for Neil. Neil has not checked in yet in chat, so Neil, hopefully you show up. But we'll copy your names. We'll paste them in here uh, after we randomize them. That'll be our draft order one through eight. Before we start picking helmets, we will give you guys about two to three minutes to trade picks. You can trade two for one. You can trade PayPal, Venmo, money, plus your pick to try to move up the board. Uh, we will have a trading period before we start. Uh, so keep that in mind, guys. Keep that in mind. All right. Let's do this thing. It's been uh, three years. We've opened tons of jersey products, tons of helmets. We've never pulled a Brady. It's time. It is time. We've pulled a, a couple of Mahomes, pulled a Rodgers. Never one time have we got Tommy Boy. I would think this would be the easiest product to get him since there's only 160 cases. All right, we should get two, I believe, two to three alternate helmets. There's the Ice, the Chrome, Blaze, Eclipse, Tribute helmets. And I got my game show card from Oklahoma State University, the Terminator, Thurman Thomas, Buffalo Bills helmet. Here we go. Standard helmet here. No alternate. It is a new style Bills helmet, though. There you go. There's the Thurman autograph. TriStar authenticated. That is a speed helmet. Nice. Thurman Thomas starts us out. Here you go, George. All right, next helmet. Again, guys, check out our live stream for uh, if you want to see us open that case box. A little too big for the table. Oh, this looks cool, whatever this is. Randy White. This should be Dallas Cowboys. Randy White, College Hall of Fame and Pro Football Hall of Fame. 1994 was a great year for him. He also got in the Cowboys Ring of Honor that year. But everything in his house is from 94. He never changes it. He's like, ah, 94. What a year. This is an Eclipse helmet. We had a Justin Herbert like this in our... Uh, Dynasty Vault, if you guys saw that. This is one of the uh, Eclipse alternates. Beautiful white ink. Wow, that's great. They should use white ink on every dark helmet. It looks so cool. Got a Thurman in your living room, Dan? TriStar Authentic. Love that. A black Cowboys helmet, that is cool. Guys, let us know what you think about the Platinum Edition. Uh, if you want us to do this break again, let us know. Email us, dynastybreaksllc at gmail.com. Uh, we always do take requests. Uh, these are a little bit higher dollar, but for a reason. Ooh, George approves of this. Wow. Jamar Chase, the new Bengal receiver, Joe Burrow's guy 
from LSU won the uh, Fred Bolitnikoff Award for Best Receiver in College Football, and I love the Tiger Stripes, baby. It is not a college helmet. This is a Bengals mini helmet. Beautiful. Very nice. Wow. How do you sign these? That's what I was wondering. How do you sign between the stripes? There, he did a pretty good job. Jamar Chase, number two. We don't get a lot of Bengals helmets. Uh -uh. I don't know that I've seen more than maybe one or two. Very cool. TriStar Authenticated. I like that. Wow. If you're a mini helmet collector, pretty cool to see a Bengals. I mean, they got that in there yeah. pretty quick. He did? Yeah, they did. They did. Oh, yeah. Jamar Chase. Oh, uh, they typically remove one of the black stripes to yep. let them sign. Yeah. That's cool. That's good to know. Dan's a big, I know Dan's a big helmet collector, aren't you, Dan? Trying to get one every team. I think that was you. I think you're right. All right, next up. Ooh, a Hall of Fame kicker. Morton Anderson, 2017 Hall of Famer. Uh, he was on the all-decade team in two different decades. I'm pretty sure that's tough to do. Pretty sure that's uh, almost impossible, especially for a kicker with their uh, shelf life and how quickly they get turned over. TriStar authenticated the great Morton Anderson, and that man knows how to sign. There you go. Big signature and a Hall of Fame inscription. That is the standard... Saints helmet, TriStar authentic, and uh, also Morton Anderson authenticated. Double authentication. What's up, OCD? Hey, our main guy. What are you doing? What are you doing up there in Washington? Which one did you get, Rich? Was it the Eddie George? Which one did you get? Did you get one of the weird ones that wasn't football related? We've had some big stuff over the years. We've had Al Pacino helmets. Curtis Martin, great signature, we've had him. All right, we heard this guy speak at the Hall of Fame uh, back in 18, I believe. Best speech out of anybody, hands down. And we heard Randy Moss, Ray Lewis, Brian Dawkins, Erlacher. Jerry Kramer finally got in the Hall of Fame. Uh, one of the Packers greats, Jerry Kramer. The guy says what he thinks. There you go, Green Bay fans. Proudly inscribing that, Hall of Fame 2018. He was long overdue. Jerry Kramer. TriStar authenticated. Not a speed helmet. Going old school again. Oh, the Jamie Foxx. You got the Jamie Foxx one? That is cool. That's cool. Yeah, we got the Pacino from uh, one of these TriStar breaks as well. Then we get the oh we got the entire national championship uh you you team Texas Longhorns yeah That was cool Yeah, it's tough to get that Pacino. We got him like a, the first box out of the first case, I think. It was like, what is this? We are going I've never seen one of these. We've never pulled one before. Trevor is going to be Trevor is not going to want to ship this. He's going to start crying. Camo. Wow. Helmet. Camo helmet of the cheetah. He's probably running so fast you can't see him anyway. But uh, might want to wear camouflage because it's really cool. Look at this. Chiefs camo helmet. This is going to be Beckett authenticated. Wow. Tyreek Hill, white ink auto. That's cool. Poor Trevor. <laughs> He's going to be like, what is this? I don't want to send it. Tyreek Hill. That is awesome. That is our second alternate. I think it's two per case, but I have heard of three before. So 
We'll see. That is really cool. Uh, you want to put camo on Hill and put Eclipse after Randy White. Okay. Uh, just after their name. Uh, camo on Tyreek and Randy White Eclipse. That way people know those are the alternates. Uh, camo and Randy White is... Oh, this is cool. The coach, man. This guy could coach some defense. He could play some defense, too. A lot of interceptions in his career, I do believe. Dick LeBeau, Hall of Famer in 2010. Dick LeBeau helmet. This is a Hall of Fame helmet. So we'll put uh, Dick LeBeau HOF helmet on this one. It is inscribed. They do sell these at the Hall of Fame. It's pretty cool. Nice signature, too. Love the penmanship. Dick LeBeau Hall of Fame helmet. I didn't write out a helmet, but I... Nah, you're good. TriStar. Authenticated. The Coach. All right, last box. Then we'll determine our draft order. Hope Neil shows up. Neil must be sleeping. I bet he is. Maybe he just checked out. He's like, I got a CD lamb. I'm done. I'm out of here. Where's my little card? My little card fell. This is Dave Wilcox. This is going to be a San Francisco 49ers helmet. Seven-time Pro Bowl selection. Pro Football Hall of Fame in 2000. So he's a Hall of Famer. This is a speed helmet. Great-looking Niners helmet. Dave Wilcox. Little-known Hall of Famer. To me, I don't know much about Dave. I do love that speed helmet, though. TriStar Authenticated. Aww. All right, that was the lineup. Still no Brady. We try. <laughs> we try to get Tom. All right. Uh, I feel like they should send us a whole case of nothing but Brady after all these years. All right, let's do the random guys six times. That'll be our draft order. Don't start making your selection yet. We're going to give you guys about three minutes to trade before we start picking. Uh, we will uh, go over there. There's the list. Thurman Thomas down to Dave Wilcox. And here is the list of names. Let's determine that draft order. Nicholas down to Travis. We are going six times. One, two. Three, four, five, and draft order is we got Dale at the bar down to Nicholas ALB from Kentucky. Copy those. That is six times on the random. So hopefully Neil shows up. Neil, you're going to be at the second pick. So we're looking for Neil ALZ if you're out there. All right, we're going to turn the sound down. For just a minute, guys, we're going to put three minutes on the clock. You can talk trade. Go ahead and uh, try to do that in YouTube chat if you wish, and we'll start picking in just a minute.
All right, guys, we do have an offer. Uh, Joey asking Brad what it would take to, for him to move up to three. So what would it take for you to move down to seven? Uh, have about a minute left. We're going to give you guys, uh, we're going to say a minute and 20 seconds on the clock when it's your turn to pick. So even Neil's going to get that. We're going to give him the benefit of that uh, before we have to go to the randomizer to make his selection. So you'll have a minute and a half to make your pick. If somebody does offer you a trade when it's your turn and you want to make a deal, just let us know. And uh, we'll confirm zip codes and everything, and then we'll continue with the draft. Bradley said he's going to stick with the three spot. Gotcha. So Neil, uh, per our terms and conditions, guys, uh, we have had people show up at the buzzer when they're on the clock. So uh, Neil's going to get that opportunity. And then per uh, the terms, he's going to get the opportunity to go to the randomizer to make his selection. We're not going to pick for him. Uh, it will be totally random. So, And really, guys, that benefits everyone else in the draft. Because if he was here, he'd probably take the second best helmet. So the odds are it's probably going to help everyone else uh, per the odds. So here we go. Uh, we're going to go a minute and 20 seconds. And Dale, you are on the clock. All right, Dale taking that Jamar Chase helmet. Actually, I did not know he was in this. That's a great one. Yeah. Uh, first, first Bengals helmet, a rookie helmet, if you will, Jamar Chase. All right, Neil, I'm resetting the clock. You do have a minute and a half, so Neil, if you're just playing a trick on us, if you're actually here, uh, let us know. We'll go to the randomizer at the end of this clock. Nice selection. I think we've had a Boomer Esiason helmet. I don't think we've ever had a Burrow. Don't think we've had a Corey Dillon. I can't remember. We may have had a Chad Johnson. I, I think Boomer Esiason may be the only Bengals helmet we've ever had. We have had one because I'm. I, that's how I knew they removed the uh, strike. Mm -hmm. When he verified that, I had I thought that's what I'd seen, but Icky Woods maybe I don't I don't remember. We don't see many of them. Uh, Twenty seconds, Neil. Last call. All right, we are going to, I'm going to move all these names up. We're going to have to go to the randomizer. Time is up. All right, Neil, uh, your selection is going to be randomized. Um, let's go to random.org. It's going to be six times the last hel or the helmet on top after six randoms is going to go to Neil. And again, uh, pretty much benefits everyone else, so... Um, here we go. Six times. One, two, three, four, five, and six. The Tyreek Hill. I think that would have maybe been the second pick anyway. The Tyreek Hill camo helmet goes at the second spot. Six times on the random. I think that might have been the second pick anyway, but a one in seven shot at it. And Neil ends up with Tyreek. 
Two receivers first. All right, Brad on the clock. Was it Ken Anderson? That might have been. You know what? That could be right. That's right. Walter says he has a Ken Anderson. Oh, that's okay, Joey. I understand, man. Uh, Bradley is taking Thurman Thomas. Hall of Famer. More importantly, from Oklahoma State University. The Thurminator. Going to Brad. Sweet hot. Thank you, Brad. Craig Ali Ali Oxen Free. Next up. Yeah, I know, Brad. You were the one that was going to uh most be affected by the by the random, so the good news is you actually had a shot for it to remain. I think if he would have been here, it probably would have been gone. So at least you had a shot at it at it not being gone. The odds were in your favor. <laughs> it did, yeah. It didn't uh didn't happen. But you ended up with a Hall of Famer. So which I think everybody left on the board is a Hall of Famer now. Randy White. All right, Randy White. A uh, very cool Eclipse helmet, man. The alternate helmets are off the board. Uh, Travis, next up. Yeah, that would have been a, that was a tough decision, Rich. I can see taking Chase just because he's a rookie. Um that would have been tough for me, though. You don't see that many Bengals helmets. Well, now that he's gone, I mean, obviously, I would have taken, given a choice, I would have taken the Jamar Chase. Yeah, LSU fan. Yeah. So, I think Dale might be in that kind of position. Pretty good case. Obviously, we're still uh, hoping one of these days we can get a Tom Brady. This is the easiest product to get one. Um, a little bit higher end. All right. Anderson. Respect the kicker, man. That's a great auto on there. Double authentication, Morton Anderson. Saints helmet going to Travis. Robbie next up. Oh, I hear you. Okay. Uh, Dan saying he's not a big fan of uh, some of the alternate helmets, so he would have taken Chase. I do think that camo helmet was cool looking. Yeah, it's different. All right, Dave Wilcox, speed helmet for the 49ers. Hall of Famer uh, went in in 2000, I believe. Dave Wilcox going to Robbie at the sixth spot. Joey next up. All right, Dick, Dick. Dick LeBeau, the Hall of Fame helmet going at seven. And Jerry Kramer going at the eight spot ends us out. And I do have a question. Some of you guys collect helmets. They mention a uh, one of the alternate helmets is a tribute helmet. What does that mean? What is that? Does anyone know what those look like? They mentioned you could get a tribute helmet. Hmm. All right, I'm going to stop the video here while we think about that question. There's your lineup. Chase down to Kramer. And uh, we'll be right back, guys. We'll tell you about Sunday's lineup.